Welcome to another episode in the series of short films highlighting new functions and application software in the EC Laser E Series alignment system. My name is Michael Turner and I'm an area sales manager at Damalini, manufacturers of EC Laser. Today we're going to talk about Base Twist, a measurement program available in the EC Laser E710 alignment system. With this program, we're able to measure the twist of a foundation before installing, for example, a large motor or a pump. First, we need to prepare everything. The measuring units are mounted on these magnetic bases that come with the E710 alignment system. I'm going to measure these four pads, A, B, C, and D, and check this foundation for twist. Twist measurement program is found under the flatness icon in the E710 unit. Place the S and the M unit on pad A and adjust the height of both units. Move the M unit to pad D and adjust the S unit so that the laser is centered on the target. Rough alignment is performed with a mechanical target over longer distances. As we're using the center point as a reference, we need to make sure that the laser hits the target while placed on the center point as well. Now move it back to pad A and remove the target. I'm now going to zero set the value. Once I've zero set on pad A, I move the unit back to pad D. I'm now going to fine tune to within one tenth of a millimeter using the digital targets in the display unit. Once adjusted, move the M unit back to pad A. I'm now going to register the first measurement. Follow the on-screen instructions and move the unit to the center point. Take a measurement and then move to pad D. And take the third and last measurement. Once pads A to D have been measured, we go through the setup process again for pads C to B. I've gone through the setup process and I'm moving the M unit back to pad C. We are now ready to take the first measurement. Move the M unit to the center point. Take the second measurement. And then move the unit to pad B. Once I register the third and last measurement, the system automatically goes into result view. In this case, pad D is 4 tenths of a millimeter low compared to pads A, B, and C. We recommend that twist measurement is performed before installing or reinstalling a machine on any foundation. If you have any further questions, please feel free to send an email to info at Thank you for watching.